What is going on, guys? Reflex here, and I'm with my bud Judd. Say what's up, man. Yo, what's up, peeps? And we really enjoyed the feedback that we got in the shout out video, and I'm glad it got the reception it did. I mean, 71 views, like 32 likes. Yeah. I mean, that's crazy, man. Yeah, that's crazy. Did you numbers, expect man. that? Nah, I didn't expect that at all because, you know, I mean, I don't really know how shout out videos do anyway, but. Yeah, that one did extremely well. Like, that one was a little bit. Too well, but I guess everyone liked the shoutouts they got, and I'm just happy to help people. I mean, you guys support us so much, and I just want to give it right back. But that's not going to be what we're going to be talking about the whole video. We're actually going to be talking about a new game that comes out, I think, next Tuesday, the 14th, and that is, go ahead and say it, For Honor. Oh my gosh, if a game doesn't look like orgasmic, then that, mm. hoo-wee, that really does look good, though. I don't know if I can make a montage on that, but just overall... Yeah. The game looks solid. Will it get repetitive? Every game does. But this game just looks good. Looks fresh, new, mm -hmm. nothing ever like it. So I want to play it. want to play it real bad. my medieval fancy. You yeah. know, they got the choice of choosing a samurai, a viking, or a, a knight. knight. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I'm going to be a samurai. He's going to be the viking, yeah. and we're going to be the duo. We might put some 2v2 action in there. Yeah. We're going to put some... Other action in there. Yeah. I don't know the stuff. We're gonna put some random shit in yeah, there. Yeah, we even gonna put us beating our dicks in there. Yeah. I mean, y'all didn't y expect stay tuned it. for that one. Yeah, if y'all know you wanna see that, leave a like if you wanna see that. Leave a comment if y'all wanna see that. Cause yeah. I wanna see it. Just say see that. You ain't even gotta. Yeah. But in all seriousness, we're really excited to just play that game because it just looks really yeah. good. It looks solid. Mm -hmm. Now, a lot of people were saying, like, oh, certain classes are OP, but in reality, the game is pretty much how it's based is everything's balanced. Yeah. Every character can be every other character. You just got to play it differently. If you go, mm -hmm. if you play one character the exact same way, fighting every other character, that pretty much you're going to have a weakness on certain spots. Like, you got to change up your play style against other people. Like, for, I think, the Nobushi or whatever on the samurai part, mm -hmm. there's you have to fight him ranged or, like, get in close real quick and make sure he doesn't get you at range because that's where he, you know, specializes. Oh, that's the big one. No, that's the no. That's I'm talking about the one with the spear. Oh, oh okay. yeah, that one, that can inflict poison on you. I think I'm gonna like that one, but mainly I'm that's just gonna be the the basic samurai, you know, with a nice sword. Mm -hmm. It's gonna look nice. I'll probably be a regular Viking. Yeah, we're gonna be that duo though. They ain't yeah. ever gonna see it. And the co-op is campaign. I said that backwards. <laughs> <laughs> No, but the campaign is co-op, and I mean, that's pretty cool. I didn't expect that, but... Yeah, because most games don't do the co-op campaign anymore for some reason. Yeah, it's kind of stupid, to be honest. I mean, they did do it on Black Ops 3. Did they do it on Advanced Warfare? I mean, Infinite Warfare? Nah, it's not on Infinite Warfare. Yeah, see, that's stupid. Yeah. But, I mean, hopefully they continue with certain games. Like, there's going to be multiple games that's going to come out, but hopefully they, you know... More decent games come out, like, you know, how Resident Evil came out. I was boss. Yeah. For Honor, hopefully, is boss, too. Because keep in mind, we seen the trailer for this game the same time, time. we saw Overwatch. Yeah. And now, it's probably, like, two years from now. We didn't think about that until after. Like, I remember talking about Overwatch. Like, man, it's been, like, two, three years since we saw that. Because <laughs> we were just sitting there in front of the TV, like, yeah, let's just, just look up. Trailers, yeah, it was, yeah. like, trailer for upcoming games. And then we saw that. We saw Overwatch and was like, oh, my. Yeah, and I amazing. felt... He can quote me on this, but I fell in love with Tracer immediately. <laughs> and then, well, what so happened was I became a Tracer main. Yeah. Best Tracer on Xbox. I can, I, I'll, I'll second that. I'll third it, too. No, nah, even fourth it. I, I fifth it. Yeah. yeah now, nah, but see, we had all the hype for Overwatch, and it was a while, like, in the future that, well, no, the trailer came out a long time ago, and now we were excited for it. And now, hopefully, it's the exact same for For Honor, because, I mean, yeah, it just looks good. If it's disappointing... So that would I'd be, be sad. That yeah, would be that depressed. Would ruin my week. <laughs> yeah, because we're we're looking excited for it. Like yeah. for some reason, I'm not excited for it throughout the year. But once it's the week before it comes out, <laughs> I start like, come on, these come out faster. <laughs> but like, man, I'm just I'm too excited. Like when I say I'm excited, I'm too excited. Yeah. But let me know in the comment section if you're excited for For Honor or even just excited for. Just any game that's going to be coming out in the future. Yeah. Let me know that in the comment section so we know. But if you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like, subscribe, and you guys know the drill. We will see you guys later.